So when everything's going right, and then all of a sudden you just get knocked for a spin and, and you're in a bad situation, what are you going to do about it? Ladies and gents, it's Cyberland coming back to you with another educational real estate video. So, get right to it. Things are going great for you. Um, your health is good. Your family's doing good. You're financially doing good. You're living your life. You're living the dream you set out to do. And then all of a sudden, something happens that you have no control over, and it just knocks you for a spin, whether that's a car accident or... Um, cancer, um, just something that's kind of out of your control. Well, you have some options now. You got to deal with whatever happened. Or it could be some type of trauma um, that's unexpected. Loss of a loved one or something. Well, um, these things can... Uh, affect you and knock you off your path to where you feel like giving up or you give up or you take a rain check on what you were doing and everything starts falling apart. And it happens to people all the time. Um, and then it, it starts to turn into a manifestation of just negative and um, even self-inflicting um, harm. So what do you um, do about it? Well, you make a choice. Um, either you know you were on your horse, you got knocked off, so you either sit in the mud or you dust off the mud the best you can and get back on your horse and ride into the sunset. And it's really all there is. Um, there's no getting around it. You make a decision of uh, how you're going to proceed. I know I have. I've had a couple obstacles where I got knocked off my path and felt some type of way and just, what was I going to do? And I sat down and thought about it and reflected and... Got my ass back on the horse and started riding towards the sunset. I wasn't going to allow anybody or anything to stop me from doing. Now, some people and, and some things can de can knock me off my path, but I'm still going to get back on my path and keep going towards my uh, goal. And that's it. And that's the thing with uh, life, you know. And even with um, dealing with my clients, it's the same thing where um, things don't work out with this home, that's okay. Things are gonna work out with the next home. That's it. You may not be in the home you want this month, but you'll be in it next month as long as you just stick to the process and understand that you're gonna get curveballs. And no home is gonna be perfect, there's always gonna be something, but that's okay. You just, roll with the punches you get you roll with being kicked around in the mud and being tossed off your horse and you just clean yourself off the best you can and get back on the horse and continue on to your uh, journey and it's not easy if it was easy then there wouldn't be a video about this and other people wouldn't have made videos about this and other people wouldn't have made movies about this and there wouldn't have been stories about this and documentaries and interviews and you know everybody has some type of demon they've had to deal with to get to where they want to be 
And I mean getting where they want to be in a righteous manner, not a wicked manner. Because some people, ugh, I don't think dealing drugs is the right way to go about it. But hey. Um, but yeah, that, that's what you do. And that's with anything. Whether that's whatever your, working, your goals are. Um, yeah, whether it's academics, um, your career, trying to get to being in your profession, trying to be the best at your profession, trying to be the go-to guy for your profession. Even playing, even being a good cook or, you know, being a gamer, you know, trying to, um, for some people, now this is a game I won't play personally, but Elden Ring, there are some people that have done some marvelous things with completing that game, and there are a select few that can do it, and they set their sights on trying to do it, and they accomplish the task. So, so with that being said, um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.